What's up guys, Knife Fanatic back again with another unboxing from Kubi. And this is the Drake. Um, it has a 14C28N and it's a G10. Let's go ahead and open her up. Oh, it looks like it's uh, heat sealed there in this plastic. We got the Migron Knives Moyarl here to open up this plastic. Great knife. Um, go check out my video on that as well. So here she is. Nice G10 scales. I like how uh, these feel. They feel really good. Let's see if I can get a close up of that. Got a little lanyard hold there with a G10 backspacer. And it looks like it has a milled uh, titanium clip there. I'm not sure. Good retention there. We got a thumb hole and a flipper tab with a captive pivot screw. Let's check the hardware. T8 pivot screw and it looks like T6 for the... Oh, I was wrong. Wow. Yep, T8 for the body screws as well and the pocket clip is not reversible so it's going to be uh, right hand only it looks like we got some nice milling uh, in this G10 so you can get your thumb in there and open her up wow really cool blade shape there it's, a, uh, it's like a sheep's foot to me Nice swedge here on the top of the blade. Nice little finger troil there as well. Let's see what we got. It's a uh, Max Kachuk design. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but anyways, we got a 14C 28 in blade, and uh, I want to say this is like a stone washed blade. Come on, focus. Yeah, cool blade shape. Nice finger troil there. We got some jimping up here on the spine. And man, this feels really good in the hands. It's a uh, it's a longer knife for sure, but man, this feels really good up here in this position. And then you can choke back here as well. Got nice access to that liner lock there. Wow, that action is nice. Yeah. This is really good. Let's check the flipper tab. Let's see what we got here. Some... Some good jimping there on the flipper tab. And then it kind of stops right there. Yeah, that is some nice action there. Yeah, this is running on uh, ball bearings as well. Let's check the blade play. Solid. No play left or right or up and down. Man, that action is so good. And this knife, uh, the price for this knife right now on Amazon is $56. So it's a, it's a really good um, knife for that price, at least in my opinion so far. But the action is really, really good. I'm surprised.
they did a good job with this uh, this hole too because you can get down here and the uh, lower end of it open it and you can also get up here in the upper end and open it you can also use your thumb What else? So let's check centering real quick. It looks centered to me. But yeah, I can't get over this this action and how good it is. overall length here it's a pretty long knife we're looking at um this little over eight and a half inches overall length with the cutting edge of uh just about three and a half inches and let's compare this to the migron valona here so valona is just a little bit longer what about the petrified fish Beluga, very, very similar as well. Um, the Savivi Voltaic. Yeah, guys, this is the Kubi Drake. I would definitely recommend this as well for a uh, a budget knife for sure. I mean, this could probably handle a lot of everyday stuff. And 14C28 is a really good budget steel in my opinion. I love it. And this blade shape is really cool as well. I can even get up here in this pinch grip position and just utilize it in uh, you know draw cuts or utility cuts, whatever. But yeah, it feels really good. And this, uh, I'm really curious to know if this pocket clip is titanium or not actually we might be able to tell here so this is magnetic I'm, I'm yeah so the pivot is magnetic titanium is not gonna be magnetic so and this isn't magnetic so I'm assuming this is a titanium pocket clip which is really nice for the price that you're paying all right guys well this is uh again the kubi drake hope you guys enjoyed like comment subscribe all that good stuff and we'll see you in the next one knife fanatic out